Hey, what's up, guys? Spruce here, and welcome back to another episode of GTA 5. Are you guys upset that I'm park? You're upset that I'm parking here, huh? Very upset. I got you. Don't worry. I'll, I'll help you out here real quick. Just give me a second, playa. You're all good. Don't worry about it. Everything will be fine. Just John Wick in your ass. You're fine. He's all right. Swear to God, could not have planned that if I tried. That was ridiculous. Um. <laughs> anyways, welcome back to another episode of GTA 5. Um. Funny story. I was just on GTA 5 uh, mods. I'm not sure how long this one's been out for, but uh, it's a challenger mod. Um, for the gauntlet, which, you know, makes sense because the gauntlet looks just like a challenger, but now it actually looks like, you know, a 2015, 2016 challenger, which is awesome. Um, another funny story is, uh, I went to the Dodge dealership today, Dartmouth Dodge dealership, and, um, I, I placed an order for a B5 Blue Hellcat Challenger. Um, well, you, like, when you go into a, a, a dealership, you have to fill out all these forms and stuff, and they, um, they uh, submitted to the banks and everything. Sorry, I couldn't spit. I don't know why I can't spit that out. I couldn't. I haven't slept in a pretty long time. So I'm. You know what? It's, it's when I make my best videos. Honestly, when I don't sleep, I'm. I'm that much more funny. <laughs> knock knock. Who's there? I don't even know, dude. Falcon J bro, dude. Falcon J bro. <laughs> Anyways, Crystalia. He's he's good. Just check him out. But uh, yeah, this. You, you be, now you might be thinking to yourself, Spears. Listen, that's fucking dumb. That's a dumb looking car. It's a dumb looking mod. It's not even. Not even flashy at all. Look at it. It's just regular, like a regular RT 5.7 liter Hemi. Here's where you're wrong. <laughs> not to say you're wrong. You're right most of the time. But listen, you're wrong in this instance. Because you can go into Santos Customs and modify it. That's what I said. Honestly, I was like, really? No, you can't. You can. Watch. Look. But yeah, if you guys are excited for the Hellcat Challenger, if I can get it. Um, I did the same thing last year. And the banks were like, no, you're not, what, are you stupid? You're not getting this? Are you, you dumb? What are you, fucking dumb? And I'm like, oh, okay. But this year, maybe the banks will be like, yeah, you know what? We've seen your YouTube videos. We'll give you one, all right? Okay. You know, they're probably not going to say that, but, you know, who knows? They might. Probably not. So, yeah, you got, uh, you got brakes. You got bumpers. You, you, you know, you can change the bumper up. Uh, yeah, you know, because perfect. Yeah, they're locked. That's the Hellcat bumper, which looks fucking cool. Um, that's just regular SRT, another SRT, um, but yeah, that's, that's the Hellcat one, you can tell because it looks meaner. Um, I think you can change the exhausts, yeah, you can make them, like, flatter. Which ones are the Hellcat? I think those are the Hellcat. Um, fenders, yeah, you can put the Hellcat badge or the 392 badge. Um, you can change the hood to, like, the satin hood or, um, the ram air. Um, oh, they're all ram air. Yeah, you can change it to the ram air. Ram air, ram air, ram air, ram air. Ram air. Um... What else? You got, uh, you got your horns, you got your lights, you got your, yeah. <laughs> wait, what? Are headlights different or something? I'm gonna have to get out of here because I can't, I can't do this. I'm gonna have to edit it, like, out in the menu because I don't have any of this shit unlocked for some reason. I don't know why. Alright, custom front bumper, here we go. Now, it was down here. There we go, there's the Hellcat one. Who fucking needs this shit anyways? You can get some custom skirts. I'm gonna put the dual exhaust on it just because. Uh, let's change the hood. Is the, the, the very last one? Yeah, it's the Hellcat hood. Um, they actually asked me if I wanted those stripes. These is the stripes on it when I was getting, like, you sit down at a desk and they, they, they build it for you or whatever. And the stripes would have been like this, but they would have been carbon. Which, you know, I don't know. They would have been, like, black-ish on, like, blue paint. Like, B5 blue paint. I'm not sure how I felt about that. Yeah, so it would have looked like that. It just looks kind of odd to me. Um, I think I could change the wheels too. I'm gonna add a turbo to it and Xeon lights. I used to call them Xeon because I'm I'm sp special. You know, this mod menu is actually kind of poopy because I can't give myself money. And I'm trying to <laughs> I'm trying to buy fucking shit from Santos Customs, but I can't. Okay, so wait, vehicle weapons? Uh, you know what? Let's go speedometer because I don't have a speedometer on. Eh, that's stupid. Yeah, that's that's nice. Those ones look the most like the Hellcat rims. I don't know why there's no Hellcat rims, but apparently there isn't. But uh, this is pretty much what the Hellcat would look like. Um, I think I can take it to Benny's and uh, do the interior stuff, maybe? Because you're, you're supposed to be able to change the interior color and all that. Oh yeah, you change the uh, the bumper too. Or, sorry, the wing. The rear wing. So SRT. I like, I like the... Mm, I think I like the black one. Yeah, because it's like... Black on black on black, and then you got like the black wing, kind of, kind of puts it all together. Um, they also asked if I wanted like the satin hood, like the black satin hood on this. And post comment, let me know if you guys would uh, would have put a black satin hood on. I I didn't because um, I don't I don't know. It's just not 
it's not my thing. You know what I'm saying? Oh, excuse me, excuse me. Oh, pardon me, excuse me. Like, I, I feel like the B5 blue is such a nice color. Like, the more you can have on the car, the better. And if you guys know what B5 blue is, you can, you can Google it. It's just, like, a really nice color. It's, it's probably my favorite color of blue. It sort of looks like this, but a little lighter than... I mean, this is kind of dark. I was trying to find the perfect, um, sort of, like, B5 blue, but I couldn't. Obviously, because nothing seems to go right when I try and make videos, you know? It doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter. All right, so where are we going to go? Let's go fuck with some Popo, -po, some 5-0, the fuzz, and see if this thing looks, like, shot up. You know what I'm saying? Let's get the cops all pissed off. I'm probably not even... Uh, can I get... Oh, shit. Sorry. Yeah, okay, there we go. The cops are coming. I'm just going to say, I don't know if they can come after me or not, but uh, yeah, they can. Hey, boys! Boom! <laughs> Anybody want some bacon? I'm just playing. That was rude. Maybe they're nice police officers. Who knows? Whoop! Whoop! I love throwing Molotovs out of fucking car. What, what, honestly, what's your favorite thing to do in a car? Like, what? Sorry. That's a really broad statement question. Well, that wasn't a fucking statement. What am I stupid? What am I fucking dumb? What's you guys' favorite thing to throw out of a vehicle in Grand Theft Auto? Shit. Me? I like throwing Molotovs. Honestly, I like throwing people more than Molotovs, but, you know, you don't always have people to throw, throw out of a, uh, you know, your car in GTA 5. I don't even think you can. You might be able to. I don't know. Ejecto Cito, cuz! You know what I'm saying? What's coming? You know what that's from? Obviously, you know what that's from. It's Fast and Furious. You knew that. We're best friends. You knew that. Pardon me. Pardon me. I bet there's somebody out there that's like, Motherfucker, I ain't your best friend. Fuck you. You know, and I'm like, ow, oh, really? It's my, my feelings. Alright, boys, chill. Alright, y'all motherfuckers need to chill out. <laughs> I like, like I just going fucking Rambo and just straight up shooting the shit out of me out of his own windshield. He's like, you know what? Fuck it. Oh, okay, I gotta get in my vehicle here. I can't. I can't gunfight fucking like 30 cops down. That ain't that ain't gonna work. <laughs> oh, Mustang. You wanna race, bro? You wanna race? Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. It's gonna be me when I get my Hellcat. I probably won't get it, honestly. I'm, I'm wishful thinking at this point, but I might. Who knows? You know what I'm saying? Everybody, wish me luck. Um, but I would be trading in the Super V on it, which is kind of sad, but, you know, it's kind of not at the same time, just because, like, the Super V is a 2012, and I mean, it's it's a fucking awesome car and stuff, but like, there's a few of them around, and I don't know, I I think a, a Challenger, I've always wanted a Challenger, and that's actually what I went looking for when I, actually, when I got the Super V, like years ago, um, but I couldn't find a Challenger, so I just, I found the Super V, and I was like, yeah, that's fucking cool, but I've never, like, driven, well, I have, I've never driven a two-door car for like a long period of time, like, I don't know. It's just cool, man. Like, two doors is cool. Like, look at that. It, just, it looks mean. And the headlights. That's, like, my favorite part of the uh, the Hellcat Challenger. The the headlights. Like, the Halo headlights. And um, the, the supercharger wine. Like, that's it. You know, the 707 horsepower helps, you know. It helps a little bit, but, you know. Pardon me. Pardon me. Do you guys know what these are? These little... You know what? Let me get out and uh, show you real quick. This little factoid. Those things right there. You see those vents? Those are negative air vents because air gets like pool. It starts to uh, create pressure, and uh, on the front end there on that grill, and then the air escapes up through the engine, so it drags the air over the the supercharger and stuff. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty cool. That's I mean that's what I said. And that might be completely wrong, but I sounded smart saying it, didn't I? You can't deny that. It's like eh, you kind of did, didn't you? <laughs> I did. Um, so let's get an infinite fucking ammo in my clip real quick. Um, infinite ammo and clip. Because saying infinite ammo is so much harder. Uh, people don't get why I make fun of that. Infinite ammo in clip. So it doesn't, like, it used to just be infinite ammo. And, you, like, you wouldn't have to reload or anything. It would just be like, yo, there's your fucking infinite ammo. But this one has to say infinite ammo in clip. Is it a copyright thing? I don't know. Honestly, I really don't know. What, is it G to blow this up? Yeah, yeah, it's G. I rebound it. Woo! Boop! I can't blow up. Peace, motherfucker! <laughs> Boop! Me and my girlfriend are going to see Deadpool tomorrow, or the next day, I can't remember which one it is, we're going to see it! It's going to be sick, I'm actually, I'm pretty excited. I've heard a lot of good things about it, and um, I hope it's not packed. Because I don't know about you guys, but going to a packed movie theater is like torture for me. It's like, eh. I, I would literally, like, I'll put off seeing my favorite movie in the world for like a year, just so it's not packed. Like, I'll fuck it, but the movie will basically be fully spoiled by that point, because, like, fucking all that, all those movie YouTube channels have uploaded, like, a thousand clips that you can just paste together and make the movie out of. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of what happened with me in, like, Fast 7. Because I, I, I didn't even see it for probably, like, a year after it came out. Just because, you know, Paul, it made me kind of sad, because, you know, Paul Walker's in it, and I wanted to save it, you know, for, like, 
I don't know, a later time. And then I saw it in theater and I was like, man, that was a fucking good movie. Why didn't I see that sooner? It's probably gonna be the same thing with Deadpool. Like, I guess it's only been out for a few weeks though, right? It hasn't been out for too long. Holy fuck. Oh, <laughs> the interior looks pretty good though. I haven't spent much time in the interior. Let me, uh, just do something real quick. Vehicle options. Uh, what the fuck am I looking for here? What the fuck am I looking for here? Auto repair? Sure, sure. You know what? Let me just fix and fix and <clears throat> fix and wash. Is that? Oh my fuck! What? Can I rewind time, please? What the fuck was that? <laughs> God damn it! You know, fucking. Uh, the fuck am I? Oh, I've got to spawn my fucking vehicle again. Yeah, of course, of course I do. Oh look at that! Fucking completely stock too, huh? Cause reasons. Fuck. Oh, there's the interior color. So you can, I think you can change it. Can you? Wait. Fuck. Hold on. Let me get on the in. Let, can I get? Okay, I can't get on the interior. Um. All right. Well, that's not doing anything. Um. Dash color. Is that doing anything? Nope. This is odd. Uh. <laughs> Uh, anyways, wheels. Hey, Tony the Tuna here. Welcome to my Hillcat Challenge. You like it? It's good. Okay. Fucking son of a... Man, it's a nice looking car. God damn. God damn. What's it? God damn it. Propane and propane. God damn it. God damn it, Bobby. Yeah, you guys should let me know what you think. Um, and I still have the same idea at, you know, putting... Let me see if I can do this here. Putting, um, spears. Holy shit. Uh, whatever putting spears along the side here so like down like this like having my logo here in the center and um, It go over and like on the other side like um, um What's it called? What's it called like the super? Yeah, that's the one <laughs> and um, mm, What else was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, we should think of a name for it if I actually get it I'm putting too much thought into this right now. I'm gonna get let down. Cause it's not gonna happen Damn banks man. They're dicks fucking dinglings, you know, they're dinguses Hi, hey, Mr. Coyote. What are you doing, bud? Hey, you want to come in? Want to come for a ride? You don't want to come for a ride? All right, that's cool. I'm down with that. Down with being fucking rejected by coyotes. I'm done with that shit. I got hit by that guy back there when I was trying to fucking take a picture of my whip. The whip. The hell cat. The hell kitty. Meow. <laughs> it's, a, it's a cat. Get it? You got it. Sorry. That was some cringeworthy shit right there, but... <laughs> I used to do, be able to do, like, a really good Gary meow. 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 Because I used to watch, uh... Okay, that was more cringe. I used to watch fucking Spongebob when I was younger, right? I mean, not even when I was younger. Fucking like three years ago, four years ago I did, honestly. It's timeless, alright? Shit never gets old. You imagine taking a Hellcat out and doing this? Fucking Motor Trend did it. You should look it up. They fucking did. No joke. They took a Hellcat, a Viper, and char a Challenger, a Charger, and a Viper out in like this type of fucking... These conditions and just beat the shit out of them. They fucking took them off-roading. It hurt. Honestly, it hurt me inside a little bit. Holy shit! Anyways, just keep moving. Did a 360, 180 backflip, triple quad, no scope, triple quad. I've already said that like three times now. I feel like Hitman whenever I use this shit. Where am I getting shot from? You guys are shooting me through fucking trees right now? Holy shit, did you see the size of the extended clip on this thing? It looks like a fucking. I always just bit my fucking tongue! <sighs> Anyways, it looks like a fucking foot-long sub from Subway. That was gonna be way funnier if I could have actually gotten it out, but... Where the fuck are these guys shooting at? Well, they don't exist anymore, just... Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't even see the guy on the bike, he just went flying. You country cops can't handle me, boy, I tell you what. God damn it. Ooh, that's gonna blow up. I'm gonna back... What, y'all can't help fucking... You can't handle Tony the Tune with a minigun? Uh-huh, what are you, pussies? What are you... What are you fucking... What are you, dumb? Can't, ow! Ow! I'll push my Hellcat at you, hold on. Get down on the ground real quick. Okay, I can't go down here. I'll push the Hellcat towards you, don't worry. It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. But yeah, just put the spears like here. Oh my god, I can lift it up with bullets? Oh, push it along with bullets. Fuck it. Taking my Hellcat for a walk with a minigun. No big deal. Well, you act like you've never fucking seen that shit before, huh? You have. Oh my god. Yeah, that was the easiest helicopter take down in my life right there. Oh my god. Thing is still fucking alive. There we go. You literally just have to aim for the fucking propeller, the rotor, whatever. The propeller? Not the propeller, the rotor. I mean, you could fucking, you could probably aim for the propeller, I don't know. This is giving me a headache. Can't even hear. Look how many fucking bullets are coming out of this thing. Look. 
Just, just, just look at, look at one burst. It's like, oh my, that's a lot of fucking bullets. Let's shoot the propeller actually here. Propeller time. See, prope propeller don't do anything. It's the rotor that does it all. It keeps the motherfucking balance. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, this guy looks like he's about to murder a child. <laughs> I'm very happy. And, uh, yeah, hope you guys have a great day. Thank you for watching. And, um, fuck, we're almost at a million subscribers. What the hell? I keep remembering that. It's like, what? Is that real? Is that real life? Am I dreaming that? I've had, I've had dreams about that before. I'm not going to lie. Anyways, take it easy, boys.